Hey kiddos, in this activity today, we're gonna make a monkey. And you're gonna need a few sheets of paper, some paint, some markers, and some colored pencils. More precisely, you're gonna need one large piece of paper to cover your workstation, two sheets of paper, one for our monkey and one for the decor, two paint brushes, one paint palette to put your tubes of paint with different colors, one glass of water, and one towel to wipe your little fingers off. Okay, great. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our first sheet of paper and we need to make the background of our jungle. Okay, so we're gonna take our paintbrush, open up our little paint tube, and add it into the dispenser. So we're gonna squeeze quite a bit of it. Perfect, close our little paint dispenser. We're gonna add also a little bit of yellow to make some jungle decorations. Awesome. So we're gonna add a pretty thick brush because we have to paint the entire background of our jungle. Okay, no paint on it, we're good to go. So we're gonna add our paint to our paintbrush. And again, we don't wanna to add too much water to our paintbrush because we want the background to be really nice and green. Great. So here we go. Let's start painting right along the edges. Keep going along to make our jungle really nice and, and bright and green. Perfect. So yeah, we don't wanna to add too much water to this part because in the background we'll get all, a little bit too moist. Perfect, so just enough so it just brushes right onto the brush and we keep going. Perfect, and it doesn't have to be kind of perfectly green in, in every single spot. It can be different shades of green because just like in the jungle, you know, in some places there's more leaves than in other places, so lots of different shades of green and just keep brushing all alongside Nice and easy, back and forth. Tiny bit more water. Keep going, going, going. Perfect. Just keep going until you see almost no paint is left on the brush. You can go over some other spots. Little bit of paint. Perfect. Great. Perfect, getting all the little edges nice and green. Tiny bit of water to mix up my paint a little bit more that's already on the page. And keep brushing back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Get all the little corners. All right, we're almost done with our jungle background. Looks good. Okay. Last little dab of paint. Let's get our corner nice and green. A little more water, mix it all up. Perfect. So now our jungle is really nice and green. Just holding it down with my little finger. And it's okay guys, just wipe your little fingers off. Perfect. So now we're gonna take our skinnier brush and we're gonna dip it in the water and we're gonna make some decorations for our jungle. So I've chosen yellow. I'm just gonna add little dots right alongside the paper. And they don't have to be even spaces apart. Just add little dots all throughout your jungle. Keep going. Perfect. So right along the side, coming down and around. Boom, 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 little dots. Snowing in the jungle with some yellow snow. Great. Almost done. Perfect. Okay, so now we're gonna take our paper and he's gonna dry off a little bit. And now we're gonna take our fresh sheet of paper where we're gonna draw our monkey. So I'm placing him right up top and the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw the different parts of my monkey. So take your colored pencil 
And right now we're going to draw the body. So the actual torso of our monkey. So you're going to take your pencil and draw right up and around. And you're going to make like a, like a swoop. So it's kind of like a giant finger. So we have to make some ears, his mouth, his arms, his stomach, and his tail. So the next thing we're going to draw are his little ears. Okay. Making a little semicircle, another little circle up and around. Perfect. So now we've made our little ears. Next thing. Oh, his is mouth. So we're going to make a little oval here for the mouth. Perfect. Next thing we need to make are his arms. So we're going to make like little French fries, but you're going to keep the upper half open. Perfect. So two little arms and now his stomach. So it's going to go inside of his body up and around. Perfect. So his little stomach is ready to go up and now we need to make the tail a little squiggly monkey tail. Perfect. So now what we're going to do is we're going to cut out all the little pieces of our monkey and we're going to put them together. So first let's take his body and cut along right around the pencil that we drew. So I'm going to cut out each little separate piece. It's a little bit easier to cut instead of having all that paper. So right alongside the head of the body. So we can make our cute little monkey. Or maybe he's an angry monkey. However you want him to be. Okay. So that little part of the body is done. We're going to put him on the side and we're going to focus on our other parts. So now we're going to cut out oop, his tail. Boom. Grab our piece of paper. Cut along the little monkey tail. Nice and easy right around the pencil. Great. Swooping right along. Kinda looks like a candy cane too, doesn't it? Okay. So be careful with your fingers right here. It's getting a little bit tricky. Whoop, right around the tail. Let's pull some of that paper out of our way. Perfect. We're gonna snip right up there so his tail is nice and cut out. Awesome, so let's put him on the side as well. Okay, so now we're gonna cut out his little ears. One little ear, two little ears. Cut on along the bottom. Cut right along the top. Little swoop. Perfect. Whoop. Careful with the little fingers again. All right, so he's got one ear. Let's cut out his second little ear. Pretty big his ears, actually. They're not very little, are they? There we go. right along the top. Awesome. Almost done with his ears. Okay. So now we need our monkey to have a mouth. So let's grab our next piece of paper. Snip. Perfect. Let's just cut up alongside his mouth. There we go. It's like an oval. A lot bigger than a human mouth, that's for sure. Okay. Almost done, guys, with his mouth. Perfect. Great job. All right, so now we have his belly and his arms left. So we've got his two little arms. So the first one, I'm going to snip right along the side of the little french fry. Swooping around. And I know that you see that we didn't finish the other side of his arm, but that's totally normal. Just keep snipping right along top. And we're going to just clean cut it. There we go. 
his second arm. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to snip right there. So it's a clean diagonal right at the bottom and cut right along his arm. Great. Perfect. Okay, both arms are cut. And now the last thing to cut out is his belly. So snip. Now we're gonna cut right alongside the belly. Perfect, right around there. Almost done. It's gonna be a super cute little belly. Okay, so now we have all of our little monkey pieces to make his body. Great. Okay, so here's his body. Let's put all the pieces together so we can see what he looks like. Okay. So we have his two ears and we're gonna paint them using this little skinny brush and we're gonna make them yellow. Perfect. So just go right along the edges. Again, you can, you know, totally paint overboard and it's gonna get just caught by the, by the bottom piece of paper. Get all of the little corners with your skinny little brush. It'll help you get the details. Set up with a little bit of water. We're gonna paint his second ear yellow. Okay, a little bit more. Nice sunny ears. Okay, let's put those to the side so they can dry. Okay, great. So now we're gonna get a little bit of orange paint, pop it into our little paint dispenser. Perfect. Switch it around. And now we're gonna really rinse our, our paintbrush because we want the colors to be really, really nice and bright so they're not mixed up with the other ones. All right. So we're gonna use this bigger paintbrush to to paint the body of our, of our little monkey. Perfect, so nice big brush strokes. Get all the way to the bottom and make his body nice and orange, whoop. So you see he's curled up like that, that's totally fine. What we're gonna do is just put him off to the side and he's gonna dry. And by the time that he's nice and dry, we're gonna glue him down to the paper anyway so he won't be curled up anymore. So right now we're just getting the color really nice and rich and on each part of the body. Okay, so now a little bit of pink. And I know you girls, we love pink, but for you boys that don't really wanna use pink, you can use blue, you can use you know any other color that you like. But for this part of the monkey stomach, a lot of monkey stomachs are pink. So I'm gonna stay true. Okay, great. So now we've made that all nice and oop, little corner. Perfect, little pink monkey stomach. Now we're gonna take his mouth, which is also pink. Great, great. Nice and perfect. Okay. Oh, that's not his mouth, it's his hand. <laughs> All right, so both little arms are gonna be pink. That's our second arm. All right, and let's keep painting. Nice and pink, go, go, go. All throughout. Awesome, so now he has two pink arms. All right, what shape is this? Now this is my mouth. Oh, nope, that's my tail. <laughs> Let's make the tail nice and pink too. I love pink. I could make almost every part of the body pink, but you know, we have to be, we have to make it a little bit more colorful. Okay, great. So now we're gonna put my tail off to the side as well to dry. All right. So basically now we're gonna take a look at what the entire monkey's gonna look like in context of our jungle that we painted before. So we have our background, which is now nice and dry. We're gonna grab our little ears and we're gonna place them just to see whereabouts do we want our monkey on our jungle. Great, so now we're gonna take our little arms 
Make sure we have enough space. Perfect. Up. Little tail. Okay, great. Monkey body. See, he's already starting to dry up, so that's perfect. Okay, looks like we have enough space. Looks good. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna start adding glue to the back of the body. So just roll it right alongside the edges first. And then add a little bit everywhere. Perfect, so now we're gonna place him exactly where we want our monkey body to be. Right alongside the edge on the bottom. Looks good. Let's move over these little monkey ears so they go right alongside and we're gonna kind of paste them two in one. Awesome, so just dab right along there with your hand. It's better to kind of push it like that so you don't get the paint right on your, on your hands. Perfect. So sneaking the arms right under the body. Whoop, gonna sneak them in right there, perfect. And you're just gonna press. So the glue that you put on your monkey body is actually gonna stick the other pieces. And the little tail is there too. So now we're gonna flip up the arms, and add a little glue on the bottom side. Perfect, so we're gonna lock those down into the jungle. And a little bit more to make sure he's really nice and Stuck right in there, perfect. Great, and then a little bit on the tail. I like clear glue because when it dries up, it doesn't make another color. Awesome, pat it right down, lift up his little ears, just a little bit so they stay in place. Little lifting, perfect, press them right down. And our monkey is in the jungle. So now we're gonna add a little bit of glue which we're gonna add for his mouth. Perfect. So we left his mouth blank. Perfect. And then we're gonna take his stomach, add a little glue to his stomach. Whoop, press down. And now we're gonna put him right on top of his belly. Perfect. So now our monkey is in the jungle. He's got a little mouth, a little stomach, but now he needs some eyes and he needs a mouth. So what I'm doing here is I'm adding his little nostrils and a smile. And then I'm making two circles for his eyes and little ovals inside. And there we go. Great job, guys. So kiddos, here's our awesome little monkey hanging out in the jungle. I hope you had a really fun time today making it and that you enjoyed yourself. Feel free to send me a picture of your drawing to tutokid.com. I'd really like to see your work. And you can ask your parents to help you log on to the website. I hope to see you soon.